Joining us now is Dr. Nandy and doctor again, the exact cause of death is still under investigation, but what is the deadliest risk in this cold weather? Alan, unequivocally, it's hypothermia. So once you're outside, your body begins to protect itself. It moves blood away from your fingers and toes because it wants to protect your brain and internal organs. If you're outside for too long in these temperatures, your organs can struggle to produce enough heat to work properly. And hypothermia sets in once your body temperature dips below 95 degrees, and this can actually lead to death. And doctor, can you explain to us why you wouldn't be able to just go inside if you have hypothermia? It's a great question, Heather. So hypothermia does this. It can slow your brain activity and you can suffer from confusion and fatigue, which can lead to you making poor decisions. And you don't have to be outside to suffer from hypothermia. It can happen indoors without adequate heating. And that's why you need to check on your loved ones, especially those who are elderly and those with mental health situations, that you want to make sure they're safe and protected in this, in this weather. Yeah, some good information for sure, right, Dr. Nandy? Thank you so much.